Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Tales of Symphonia. We're gonna turn on some switches. Oh, new world. Oh, this takes me just straight up. Damn it! Fuck. Lowers that side now. You have to go all the way back. Man, I like the old puzzle better. I don't have to keep walking between way. Yeah, walking between like twenty different shites. Shite! I want that fire drake to join the team. I this ain't idea. shite. This is the world you live in. What did I think of some like blue song for a second? What what song is like, um, something something in the world you live in? I don't know what you're talking about, but I don't know what you know what I'm talking about, right? I want to say there's a stretcher. Push the button. But what if... Push the button. Dink. What did that do for me? It opened a path in the middle of the wall. I believe. No, no, no. This is the... No, this is the top door. I think that's the bottom door. What about that button? We'll do that later. What if we click the button, like that one time in Triet, actually, and we end up missing treasure because of it. You don't miss treasure. Sweet. Treasure misses you. <laughs> I don't think it works like that. I mean, I'm not a professional. Oh, we can catch something. Let's not capture this one. Let's end it. This split in half. Blood splatters everywhere. Oh, there's a survivor. It's <laughs> over. One after the other and jump, pity jump. Cut them in half. Who we get? Who we get? You did it. What's your best jabber? Nope. I already have one of them. It's a damn spider. It's a goddamn spider. To be fair, a spider that big, I think. I'd probably go insane. And then you let it live, and it hands you some apple gel. I don't wonder where it got gel. Oh, shit, I was wrong. It's not this one. You're right. It's the middle one. You're right. Oh. I don't know why I thought it was the bottom one. Daddy. I don't think I would ever grab the apple gel if it just handed me green gel. I'd be like, hmm. Suspicions. You must click the button. Rising. Wait. Wait. Can we re click a button? Yes. Can we click a button one? Okay. Can we re click the button on the top floor, right? And that uh, lowered the other one, right? Yes. If we raise the one on the bottom one, Weak. we can go down the middle and get those two treasures. Do you see this? You saw yeah, it? It's not, it's not coming from uh, any of those. So literally, Genus is just in the background shooting fireballs. That's dope. That's it. That's actually pretty cool. And weird, they've never done that in any Tales of game, where someone who's not actually in your team can still help you. Well, I think that since they're like key characters that are just sitting in the background, they probably like do some little thing to help you. I guess. I guess that makes sense. Ugh. Oh, no, you, you're wrong, Peter. You can't reactivate them. So, I have no idea. No idea. I guess activate one of the other ones as we're going, and hopefully that will get lowered or raised, I guess. Mm -hmm. Don't know. Jabberwocky! Let's finish this quickly. Oh, I think I'll all have high pitch screams with like people that have a blunt sword. I say I'll beat you with a pretzel. <laughs> I'll beat you with my delicious pretzel. It's so you don't like pretzels. You don't give them enough credit. I don't like hard pretzels. The no. soft ones. The soft pretzels are amazing. Soft ones with some good spices and a nice honey mustard dip. Yeah. Have you, have you had honey mustard pretzels? You can't have honey mustard pretzels. Yeah, you can. You can also have cheese dip, too. Cheese dip is dope. Now, all of the dips are dope. I don't think I've ever had a bad pretzel dip. Then again, I don't think I've had all pretzel dips, so there could be one that's bad. Wait, where am I going at this point? Oh, right, right, right. Click. I stick my hand in it and just lit on fire? It's pretty metal. Wait, what? what? Upwards well, and onwards. Everything is frozen over. Is it? You said Ignis's core is here. Is that the Centurion of Ice? No, fire. Hmm. Wait, fire? But this place is freezing. Hmm. I believe the core's loss of control is having a negative effect. The hmm. Centurion's power is working in reverse. So that's why it's so cold in here. Fire. What are you thinking, Rain? Ifrit? You said that there was a centurion of light in the basement of the Tower of Mana. That's right, but Lloyd took it from us. It seems that the centurion's cores are located in the same places where the summon spirits used to be imprisoned. Tenebrae, are centurions and summon spirits related in some way? No, nothing of the sort. 
Though Centurion's cores are located in places with unusually high concentrations of mana, the Centurions use their elemental attributes to counterbalance these mana anomalies. So, wouldn't that mean we'll find Centurion's cores by visiting all the places where the summoned spirits were? There's no need to follow Lloyd. I was just thinking the same thing. Well, that was kind of obvious. Mm -hmm. Really? Maybe we can beat Lloyd to the cores now. I'm not sure about that. Lloyd knows where the summoned spirits were located as well. If he's realized this, it doesn't give us any advantage. There's no way I'm losing to Lloyd. Genus, I understand how you feel, but the only one who can erase Emile's doubts about Lloyd is Lloyd himself. I know that, but it's still difficult. You can't just go from that to nothing. Keep shooting the firewalls, bro. <laughs> Shoot them firewalls. How much treasure we're missing, huh, won't we? This feels bad. By the way, did you see the memory seal that's still there? Mm -hmm. I go there. Oh. Shink. Now that was where Freed was, so it's fine to Freed. Weird, but alright. Oh, we have like a secret passage behind a creep. Ah, I think I found it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The treasure. Whoa, holy shit. I want it. That's a chimera. Bro. I want it. It's a chimera. I want it. It's gonna be on my team. The manticore is thank quickly. you. Manticore, manticore. This might be bad. Yeah, he lives my aerial combo. Usually, but I one shot anything that's not a boss. Oh. You wanna go, huh? Spear cast resurrection. Oh, my God, that was easy. I didn't notice Fenrir actually took care of the other Manticore quicker than <laughs> we could take care of ours. Yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fenrir, chill. Making us look bad. They're making us look bad. A stone block. Okay, there's gotta be something to that. That must be like an evolution thing. We're gonna have to check the synthesis guy. And then I'm gonna have to. Whoa! What was that? Golems and Manticore! I'm all of them. Mostly Manticore. Manticore! Manticore! Arc Nova! Let's see if it dies. Pretzels! Oh, May my pretzel be the pretzel that wins. I think I did enough damage to win. And he survives. <laughs> Looks over There's you. No huh? And so smacks away Fenrir. Yes. <laughs> That's when you know we're in trouble. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Shit, we're going to a too high of a level. <laughs> We've gone too far. We've gone too far. We're going to go back. Shave? Shave? Yes. How would I shave? The green shaves. The green shaves? Why do you shave green? Mm, shave the green. What you don't know is I'm actually an Oompa Loompa. <laughs> no one must know. <laughs> That's pretty really intense. Like, I know. But like covering everything on the skin. It's like skin powder and so stuff. So you're not the orange? <laughs> that guy would be a little too intense for me, I think. But like in the negative way. So that is Ignis's core. Amazing! It sparkles so magnificently. I thought Here you were going to cast some dark magic on me. Again. So then I guess you've already seen my sister in ruin mode. Ruin mode? Ren's an absolute maniac about ruins, ancient civilizations, and stuff like that. More so now than she was before. I'm yeah. not a maniac. I'm a researcher. Mm hmm. Huh, what are you right, saying? Right, right. Anyway, she always gets like this when she sees ruins. Hey, that's just like Emil when he's in his Ratatosk mode. Wait a minute. I'm not sure those two things have much to do with each other. Yeah. Marta, I want to see the ritual for hatching a centurion. Perform it! Jesus. Right. <laughs> Did you see Jesus' face? Jesus. Uh, I don't have much to look at. We didn't hatch the Ventus one. We just kind of snatched it and left. Oh my god, rain. 
As Ignis's powers <laughs> return, Emil, as a knight of Ratatosk, you should also awaken to new powers. <laughs> so, um, what is he gonna sing now him? we need to recruit fire elemental monsters. That would gradually bring back Ignis's powers. And I should get stronger too, right? What if there's a special ending if you actually do capture all the creatures? That'd be pretty awesome. That would be pretty awesome. Hmm? Oh. Low. It's actually gonna say loading, but. I guess I was too late. I knew you would show up. Emil, wait! All right, Lloyd Irving, tell us. Why are you trying to collect the Centurion's cores? Hmm. <laughs> Marta and I are doing all of this in order to save this world. We have to find all of the Centurion's cores so that we can wake up Ratatosk. Please, give us Lumen's core. All right, that's enough. Hand over Ignis's core. We gotta find him again, don't we? Marta, we have to take back Lumen's core by force. Let's get prepared. Why even try to reason with this murderous man? Who killed innocent people in Palma Costa in cold blood? Transform, maybe? Mm hmm. And make you stronger? Ah, just gotta wait for the loading. Come on, Lloyd. You have to tell them. Tell them that you didn't attack Palma Costa. All of these rumors about you. You didn't do any of that stuff, right? Hmm. <sighs> Come on, Lloyd, please answer me! Yes, Lloyd. Is there something you can't tell us? What is it? Or perhaps the rumors about you are true? I don't have to answer you. Now then, hand over the Centurion's core. If you refuse me, I won't hesitate to take it by force. Got to try and it. Alicia. Oh. Ooh. Well, Alicia, a surprise attack by screaming out die is still have much bad. to learn. Wait a minute, boy, wait. Ah! Whoa, Jesus. This doesn't look good. That monster is blind with rage. Damn it! Here it comes. Oh, I think yeah. it a little bit blind with rage. <laughs> Surprise! Not foaming at the mouth. Jesus, man. <laughs> it's all parked. Look sure that! I'm gonna have to the little one first. I thin down the ranks. Oh, yeah. uh, a little bit tanky. Oh my! Peter, quick resurrection! I'll hold it back. Don't get the whole circle. God of healing, bless those that stand before you. Oh, Jesus. I'm tripping out there. I know. Bless me the righteous power to vanish evil. Radiant Ron! This <laughs> Oh my god, what happened? <laughs> What's going on? Oh, almost killed him. Let's kill everything else out in that world. Apparently both you and, uh... Friend, we are severely poisoned. Everyone leveled up. Jesus, holy crap. Yes, Sky Combo 2! Making oh. Oh, that's you, that's you. Some charcoal and a bird egg. <laughs> it's like, wait a minute. Why are these things together? <laughs> that monster. It must have followed us all the way from the entrance. Well, uh, I think you're right. Lloyd ran off when he heard its roar. Damn it. It may be too late, but let's go after Lloyd. Right. Uh, Ratatosk mode. Mm -hmm. Ratatatatosk. Let's see what that is. Obtain Ignis. Then let's kill Ignis. Mm. Right. Mask. Blood Mask 2. I gotta check these skills out first. 
Sky combo? Oh my god, it costs so much. Wait, let's see this. Havoc Strike? I don't use Phoenix Rest that much. I do like Havoc Strike. I don't lie about that. We got some Sky Combo too. How would you shut the fuck up? Don't you be a bitch? <laughs> Why must you be a bitch? I don't know. Don't, don't, don't drink for you. Phoenix Rest. Or... Strike, Would you like this Gala thingy? Yes. Oh, oh. You have a lot more spells than I realized you did. You have Photon! Lordy, Lord, Swallow Lord! Dance. <laughs> Swallow Dance, no? Where is that? There. Photon! When did you get Photon? Uh. Mm. <laughs> Not gonna tell me? Fine. Be a dick. You're the one that's been playing more than I have. I haven't played since we last recorded. It can't be easy making a pack that changes your whole personality on top of giving you new powers. Indeed. Oh no, sounds cool. I'm sure Emil has his hands full simply controlling the power he receives from Ratatosk, which is why he often can't control his own emotions. Then he's just like Rain when she's in ruin <laughs> mode, giving in to her desires, unable to control her maniac urges. Ow! That hurts! <laughs> Just like me. Good thing you just got smacked and had a roundhouse kick. I still remember from like what I I know. Three. Fucking kick. Send you flying. Yeah. It's like, oh my god. <laughs> She's a martial arts master. I don't remember what I'm looking for. Shit. Right, okay, now I remember. Let's see, any better? Monster level. Ooh. Hmm. This is clearly better than that, but... Mm, Monster Lover. I think that's the one I'm gonna go with. I think so as well. Mm, yes, mm, man. Mm, yeah. Oh. No! Such an invaluable cultural treasure. These poor ruins. Here comes hmm? ruin mode. Rain truly is a multifaceted individual. Are you really that upset that the ruins are ruined? Whoa, Emil, careful what you- Of course I am! <laughs> you mean to say you're unaware of the cultural, the historic, the scientific value of the Tree of Ruins! <laughs> Listen closely, the Tree of Ruins first came to prominence two like, generations oh, kind of ago, when the spirit <laughs> like, oh summoned God, his no. hellfire and- I was like, what have we done? We're in for it now. <laughs> Jeez. Anyways, that'll be it for this episode of Another Life First Grab, or comment in the bottom section below. See you guys next time. Peace! Peace.